out of here, boy. I bet all them white executives that pay your motherfucking ass got security. You don't judge them for that. That's sad, Jack. You just expose yourself. Kudos to you, my nigga. You the real one, cause you jumped in the stands and swung on some five, six, seven, uh, six foot drunk white man. Yeah, you a bad motherfucker. And I know how you coming. <laughs> that don't even make no damn sense. You know how I'm coming. Nigga, that's how I talked when I was 17, 18. No, actually, I was like younger than that. I was a little stupider then. But once I got a job and take care of my and had man responsibilities right around the age of 14, I had to grow the fuck up and then leave childish ways behind because I had what was called responsibilities, dumbass boy. But you, all you want to do is make yourself look like a big man in front of these women. That's why you talk like that. <laughs> but I think they see now who the bigger man. <laughs> Ouchie! <laughs> I'm gonna let you go, man. I hope you say something else, though, boy. I'm getting a kick out of this shit. You say we were joking, right? Because I'm having a good goddamn time. First thing you said was this was a joke. But you keep getting more and more like it ain't no joke. <laughs> My life is dead and I'm a dirt. <laughs> Woo! But you still joking, though. So I'm not mad. You still joking, my nigga. Wakanda. <laughs>